Hey everyone, Sering here. So today I have this super glamorous and hot date night look. So if you want to look expensive using affordable drugstore makeup products, then this is the video for you. And to top it off, Amazon is having their Valentine's Day sale. So all of these already affordable products are at a discounted price. So what more could you ask for, right? So I'm starting off with the Sugar Coffee Culture Hydrating Mist, which is very refreshing and very very hydrating at the same time next i'm going to take my lacme argan oil uh, which is basically an oil and serum and it's really really lightweight and it gives a very nice boost of radiance to my skin my skin looks really dewy and glowy so i absolutely love it moving on with my current favorite daytime moisturizer this is the simple hydrating light moisturizer which i feel works beautifully underneath makeup for foundation i'm using the classic l'oreal infallible foundation which i think is one of the best drugstore foundations out there and oh my god you guys the elf beauty blender is my current favorite blender i mean the shape of it the material everything feels so perfect absolutely love this beauty blender next for highlighting again i'm taking the l'oreal infallible concealer which is my absolute favorite again like this provides full coverage and the finish is just so skin like it's really really beautiful and it's also very very long lasting so i've been really loving this concealer and using it almost every single day to contour my face i'm taking a darker shade of the makeup revolution define and conceal concealer and as you can see i'm just blending it out with a soft fluffy brush first and then taking the same sponge i'm gonna go ahead and pat around the edges so that everything looks nice and seamless for blush, I'm taking the Daughter Earth Lip and Cheek Tint. This is basically a cream blush and you want to go very light handed because it's very, very pigmented. So I like using this with my stippling brush and I'm extending whatever is left on the brush towards my temples to add some color to the face. So let's go ahead and give some color and definition to the other side of my face as well. Now it's time to set everything. So firstly, I'm just dusting a little bit of the Maybelline Fit Me loose powder all over the face. And then I'm also going to take the same powder and bake around my jawline. As you can see, I'm just baking underneath my contour to make it look a lot more cleaner and sharper. And then I'm also going to bake underneath my eyes because a flawless looking base is a must for smoky eyes. Next, I'm taking the most underrated palette, I think. This is the Sugar Into Wonder Woman Mixed Palette. This has a whole bunch of products for your entire face and eyes as well. And it's a really beautiful palette. I mean, I definitely feel this deserves so much more hype than it gets. I absolutely love it. So I'm taking the contour shade and contouring around my forehead. Then I'm taking the blush, which is a beautiful peachy shade, and applying that over the cream blush to make it last the entire day next i'm also contouring under my lip area and the sides of my nose and finally i'm taking the same contour shade and i'm applying that all over my eyelids because we are going to be doing a bottom heavy look today so i'm keeping the eyelids very very light and soft Moving on to the brows, I'm taking the Sugar Brow Definer and nicely outlining, filling and shaping my eyebrows. And I feel like this one has a really nice formula for an eyebrow pencil. It's very, very easy to work with. And as you can see, the shade is also really perfect for my hair color. Next, I'm taking this super creamy pencil by Shambo and I'm going to generously tightline my lower lash line. And you want to make sure that the pencil is creamy because we are going to be smudging it out with a pencil brush and keep smudging it till you get a nice smoky effect like that. Next, taking the same product on a flat angled brush, I'm going to extend it and create a nice cat eye wing and make sure to keep the line very fine. 
Then taking this eyeliner pen, which has a very, very fine tip, I'm going ahead and extending the inner corners and also darkening out the outer wing to get that nice definition. Taking the same contour shade once again, I'm going ahead and blending out the harsh edges of the black eyeliner and I'm really blending that out to get a soft look. Next, I'm going to tight line my upper lash line as well. And finally, taking this beautiful warm bronze shade, I'm going to go ahead and add that to the inner half of my lids to give it a subtle glow. Moving on with my favorite mascara of all time, the L'Oreal Lash Paradise Mascara. I'm going to coat both my upper and lower lashes with it. Next, I cut up my lashes into small strips like that and I'm only applying them to the outer corners of my eyes to really enhance the whole cat eye thing going on. And as you can see, that looks so nice. Oh my god, I am absolutely in love with how this eye look turned out. Lately, I have been obsessed with a rounded lip shape. So what I do is I put my lips together and line my lips like that. And this creates a beautiful, rounded and very, very pouty lip effect, which I absolutely love. After lining my lips, I go ahead and smudge it out with the help of my fingers. And finally, I'm adding a lighter shade of this Rennie lipstick on the center of my lips. Finally, taking the highlighter from the sugar palette, I'm highlighting all the high points of my face. And guys, I lost the natural lighting by the time I finished filming, so I had to turn on my studio lights. So that's the reason why there is so much of a difference. So finally, I went ahead and set all of that makeup in place. And this is the final outcome. I really love how the look turned out. And guys, all the links to the products will be mentioned down in the description box. I hope you guys have a lovely Valentine's Day wherever you are. And yeah, if you like this video, don't forget to hit the like button. And also please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I will see you next time.